Hello everyone, I hope that you are doing well. I'm at the park with my kid, with Paul. Ça va Paul? Quoi, tu veux venir? Ben, je vais te la porter. La porte? Ouais, qu'est-ce que tu veux dire à la caméra? C'est un. Ben, c'est les amis. C'est les amis qui regardent papa et puis Paul et maman. Qu'est-ce que tu veux leur dire? Maman est pas là. Maman elle est à la maison. D'accord. Ah. So yeah, um, I'm in the park with Paul. Attends, mais putain. Ah. Voilà. ah non non non, c'est papa qui garde. <rire> ah, mais pourquoi Qu'est-ce que tu veux faire qu que tu... tu veux dire quelque chose ou pas <rire> C'est juste pour prendre, on peut pas. <rire> Qu'est-ce que tu veux dire Là, il y a sa main. Donc voilà, uh, that was Paul. So here you can see uh, the Eiffel Tower and everything. And I'm going up to the top of here because we are going uh, to the top. That's where we are. We are on the top of the hill here. Something quite funny. I remember when my grandmother, she came to this city on the, a little bit on the outskirts of Paris. Oh, look, the horse they are. Regarde, regarde les chevaux. Paul, t'as vu Regarde les chevaux, Paul, là-bas. Regarde, regarde. Regarde les cavaliers. Paul, Paul. Regarde les cavaliers. Ils sont beaux, hein Viens voir. C'est la police et ils disent qu'ils ne sont pas autorisés à boire, ce qui est bien. Ils ne sont pas autorisés à boire l'alcool. Ce qui est bien. Ils ne sont pas autorisés à boire l'alcool au parc. Je pense que ce genre de police est très bien parce que les gens aiment les animaux et ils les écoutent beaucoup plus. Ok, mais en tout cas, je suis en train de me And so I'm, I'm, uh, we are, my grandmother, when she came to Saint Cloud, at the time, you know, there was no pollution. It was in the 19, 19, after the war, you know, 1950s or something. Then she came here and she said, I don't want to live in Paris. It's too polluted. The pollution will kill us. It was in the 1950s. I need, I need the grass. I need the trees. And then she came here on the sea over there. I'm not sure if you can see all the forest and everything. And now it's really polluted. Usually you can, you can often see the pollution all over, all over the city, over there, you know. And uh, that's often how it is, you know. <laughs> that's often how it is. Paul, viens, on va aller jouer en haut, là. Viens, on va aller jouer en haut. Attention, hein. ah, tu veux voir les poissons Il y a peut-être des poissons ici. Ça va pas tomber dans l'eau. En haut, il y en a des poissons. Yeah, yeah, so um, that's the thing, and I really feel, she was a visionary, huh? she was saying pollution will kill us, uh, it will be not unbreathable, and she was right, she was right, and uh, now you can see how it is in China, you know, and today this is again going to be a, a short video about China, oui, chérie, and, ah, il y en a un là-bas, ils sont là-bas, les poissons au milieu, t'as vu, faut faire le tour, vas-y, vas-y, and, 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 you know, uh, I often, I often, uh, I often tell you, yeah, China is, and this is the video, but China is the future of mankind, and not in the right way, you know. It's terrible, terrible. Uh, that's why I will never go back there, that's one of the reasons. You know, you have to know, I wanted to go back this year. This was going to be my last year, I told you this quite often. I didn't expect that the, the China changed so fast, and now that you, you have Xi Jinping, everything changed so fast, and I was not welcome, unwelcome uh, over there, because now you is total control. And that's the topic of today. Uh, nationalists took over in China, and something that... T'as vu, c'est un tétard. Ouais, c'est un petit tétard. C'est un petit tétard, il va devenir une grenouille après. Tu vois Ça va devenir une grenouille après. Okay. And, and you know, the nationalists, they took over. The nationalists took over. Means... You know, it means, um, it was not like this. It was not like this when you had, uh, when you had Deng Xiaoping. It was not like this when you had Hu Jintao. Now it changed. Now it's the extreme right, the extreme nationalist. And, and extreme right is not like Trump, you know. It's not like Le Pen, huh? it's 10 times worse. So you have to understand. This is, this you have to understand. It has to be very clear for everyone who is watching. And uh, what I want to tell you is quite often I told you, the core value for Chinese people is money. And then, recently I discussed with a friend of mine who has been in China, or in France for maybe 20 years. I don't know, no, no, less than this, maybe 15 years. And he's married with a French woman and they never had a kid, but okay. And this guy is very, very educated. I'm really amazed with him because 
he read. He read more than me in French, you know. He read all the classics. He read all the books. When I see this guy, I'm like, wow, you know. Uh, he came to France and he adopted the French language and he adopted everything. Regarde le chien, Paul. Attention, tu vas lui faire peur. Attends, attends, attends. attends. Il a peur de toi, le chien, Paul. Hé, hey, 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 Paul. Paul. Paul, qu'est-ce que tu fais là Non, reviens. Paul. Il va te mordre, arrête. Non, hé, hey, Paul, Paul, viens. Viens vite. Tu reviens vite, Paul. Hé, hey, il va te mordre, le chien. C'est pas bien ce que tu fais. Il a peur de toi, il va te mordre. Viens ici tout de suite. And yeah, so the core uh, value in China, I often tell you, it's money. Um, and in fact, I'm wrong. I'm wrong. I realized I'm wrong. The core value is not money. The core value is network. Network. What you call the guanxi. Guanxi, it's a Chinese word that says network. You know, they are, when you learn about China, one of some of the first concepts that you will learn is the concept of face and the concept of network. Face and network. What is network, Guanxi? The power that you have. What kind of power do you have? Viens, viens, Paul. The power that you have, you know. And uh, I can tell you, um, uh, power is more important than money. And recently, it was very clear in China. You know what happened when you had, when you didn't have the nationalists who had power? You had some big businessmen, big Chinese businessmen, and they became very powerful. They, they reach a very high uh, level. They reach a very high level in society, you know. And then, uh, and then, uh, and then, all these guys. Recently, they thought, oh, I'm rich, I'm wealthy, I can do whatever I want. And then they were kicked out. So there was the president of Wanda, for instance, Wanda Group. This guy, he, uh, he bought back, uh, I don't know what's part of the, the studio, from Hollywood studio. And, and then all of a sudden, he decided he was threatened by the power. And then he decided, I have to, to leave China quickly. I'm not safe here. I will end up in jail. You know, and Xi Jinping just doesn't let him go out. And they took most of his uh, company. You know, then there is the Jack Ma. So Jack Ma, all of a sudden, he was very popular. He had a very high position. And all of a sudden, he said, I now decide to retire from the company. And everybody was like, oh, Jack Ma, he retires. Nobody got any thinking, you know. But for me, I know very well. I know very well where he retired. Or I, I think I know, you know. I think I know where I retired, you know. I retired. He, he, he retires because uh, Xi Jinping told him, hey, now it's time to leave. Now it's time to leave, you know. Because now the government, they control everything. Everything belongs, you know. You need the network. If you have the network, and Jack Ma had the network, so he, he was working together with the family of Xi Jinping, you know, he was part of the family of Xi Jinping. But if you don't have the network, you're gone. No matter how much money you have, no matter if you are like Bill Gates of China, you don't have the network, you're gone. So the most important, that's the network, the network, the guanxi, the power, you know, and that's the main value. And I was discussing this with my friend, that's, that's what I realized. Power, money. I always tell you, Chinese people always only want money, only want money. No, that's not what they want. In fact, they want face. And it's true, I'm talking, telling you uh, at the government level, but it's true for everyone in China. Everyone in China. So oh, they want money, they want a big car, they want this. No, they want face. Why they want face? Because they want power. And they're going to help their families. Why are they going to help their family? I help you, you must help me back. We are together in it. It's like. Uh, le clan, you know, it's like the group, you know, like uh, in France we have something similar. It's very, you know, it's a very, uh, in fact, um, I would say, okay, primitive. It's a very primitive way, you know, of being. Like you have, uh, you have the kids, you have the family, you have, uh, yeah, in the in the Middle Age it was the same. The family of the king, and you make the alliance. You marry with this with this woman because her family is very strong, or you marry with that man because his family is very strong. Then your two kingdom will be together, or you two lords will be together, and that's how it is. So the power, the power. Oui, Paul. Si, c'est le parc là. Regarde, on arrive par là. Okay, and let me leave you. Let me leave you. Now we we'll climb a little bit. Nice view over Paris for you. Nice view over the over the forest. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oui, oui, chérie. I love you all. And again, uh, this will be, I think, maybe. Attends, je termine. 
On y va, il est juste en haut. Il faut juste marcher un peu, c'est en haut. This will be probably one of the last videos that I do about China. So don't worry for all the Wumao, this channel is going to change. Because I have said, I have said, oh, je vais te porter, je vais te porter après. This will, because I have said everything I need to say. I'm not here to do China bashing. I don't care. You know, I don't care. I am explaining. I have something that I know, that I learned, that I have to share with the whole world. It's the same as if I know, I told you about the yakun fruit, I told you about... I need to share this knowledge that I have. It took me time to understand this. It took me time. It took me time to understand about the yakun fruit. It took me time to understand about myself. So I want to share with you, because that's how I am. I'm not like keeping secret or... If I know something, I share with you. If I, if I know something good and I think it's good, I share with you. I make mistakes, people make mistakes, but I am not uh, being mean and keeping to myself. And this is important knowledge that I gather and important understanding. And this is also my perception. You have yours, I have mine. But I'm not, I'm not here to do China bashing. And I have said everything I wanted to say about China. Or maybe I will have uh, some, some ideas that I get, but I think I dig, I dig, I dig. Now I have told you everything, you know. So that's it. I love you all, everyone. A bientôt. <laughs> okay.